Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more Circadian Dice. One of my favorite games, the Roguelike Dice Builder itself. We're going to be playing as the Bard. For the first time ever, I'm going to be playing as the Bard. It did not exist when I last played the game. This character and the next over here. Uh, brand new in the 3.0 version. So I've got already queued up here in, I believe, the Infested Sewers. We're going to just be taking the relics that are, you know, you get one extra gold, you get more uh, ability charges. Just things that are going to let me uh, see what's going on in the character. I already see something. Note. Gain a note for every note symbol on this face when you roll it, but not when keeping it. Okay. But, but I mean, it doesn't say quite what it does. Whenever you kill or capture a non-chest, non-door enemy this turn, gain notes equal to its maximum health. I activate for... What the hell? Your current notes. Use notes to activate song effects. You cannot have more than 32 notes. What the heck? So, we can stack up a whole bunch of notes. You can either gain 4 health at the base, 4 temporal gold, get 2 wild gems, gain a random ability, unless you have 7. Uh, deal two piercing damage to every enemy, four gold, and enough experience to reach the next level. Oh my god. Gain four shield, four attack multiplier, set your health to its maximum, lose four fear, spawn a chest in every single empty slot, gain four streak once each run. Very strange. Very wild. Gain a re okay, gain a reroll this turn. Gain a shield and a temporal gold, so temporary gold, for every face you roll with at least one node or white gem. Whenever you kill or capture a non-chest, non-door enemy this turn, gain notes equal to its maximum health. This is this is wild. <laughs> Absolutely wild. I mean, getting this sounds pretty appealing. Like, honestly, it'd be pretty appealing anyways. Um Gain a shield and temp gold for every face with at least one note or white gem. Interesting. So, I mean, would we get... Uh, is it realistic to assume we'd get enough to really get a kill? I, I, I'm not so sure. Man, I, I don't know how to... Okay, so there's a note. <laughs> we, we got one note. It kind of it plays it and it sort of just rolls off there. Interesting. I, I... <laughs> so we don't have kills here, though. You know what? Maybe we at this point we want we want to reroll because this was a pretty bad get there. Okay, so we have one temp gold. I mean, it's irrelevant unless we want to reroll twice here. Activate verse gives us four health. I don't think so. I guess I'll just get petrified. Oh, I didn't get petrified because I rolled a shield. We're golden. We're golden. Like, is this worth it? Boast to get two notes? I'm not sure. We're at six. So yeah, the next one is four temp gold. Like, I don't know when we're gonna wanna ta like, tap out is the big thing there. Uh, sure, let's go for that. Non-chest, okay. Three gold. Boom. Triple HP, there's a piercing and a coin that we can add to a face. Tempting, tempting. Kind of want to see more notes show up, though. I don't hate that, but, like, I get... Ooh. Oh! Oh, if only. I love what I see here. Activate verse. It's, it's very tempting. As is taking this. Uh, activate verse, get four temp gold. See, like, if we can get a, a note or so here... I kind of want to activate to. Oh my God, to get this. There's, <laughs> there's a lot happening. I, I, I'm liking it. It's definitely very unique. Um, uh, happily gonna go for that. Chrono punch, stun the target enemy, send it to the future if possible. Power cord, do two damage to the target enemy. If you have four or more notes, do four damage instead and lose four notes. I see, I see, I see. So we're really, we're really going in on, uh, on a lot of that stuff here. Give me a lower chest. I'm, I'm very cool with it. Aspect of healing. Give two heart symbols to the target non-trap face. Sure. Uh, I've made a mistake. 
I, I've made a mistake. I don't actually have the ability to kill. Um, do I? Yeah, I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I got greedy. I went for the chest there. This is the best we can do, and we can't just do anything else. Activate the verse. Play the song. Doesn't really matter, does it? Hey. Uh, coins... Or a bunch of gems. Honestly, we don't have a we don't have a use for blue gems, so I'll take the coins right now. Uh, interesting, interesting. So we can get power cord. Which is tempting. So, deal one damage for each symbol on the face. I, I don't think I even really want to go for that. Like, I could take this to get a uh, power cord and get a kill in the middle. That's not too terrible. I also like the idea of getting, f like, a ton of coins. That sounds fantastic. And I, I like, because of the armor here, this does, it reduces your non-piercing damage taken by one. I can't remember if splash attack gets canceled by it or not. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Well, we could heal. Now our power cord would do four damage, which I actually don't really... I wouldn't really want it to do. Like, let's just get a kill. Except this, we're going to get one petrify. One petrify on that, of course. It's a, it's a pretty good one. We have some pretty weak faces on our die for the most part. Like... Ah, yeah, here's the thing. I don't really want that... Power cord will use up all four notes. But I don't really want to keep taking damage. I could activate my verse first. Activate the verse, and then we can power cord for two because it doesn't really matter. I'd probably rather take two damage. Like, I know that this means this is going to be useless, but I'd rather take two damage than take one damage and get petrified again. 100% right now. Okay. Again. We don't have a great way of killing him. In fact, we have no way to kill this guy. Unless we use power cord. And now we're going to have to do the four damage power cord again. That is... That's getting so annoying. We could maybe get to the point where we get... Um, the temp gold instead... Like, I can't do anything with this. Bang, bang, boom. Hip, hip, hooray. We're going to just be... Yeah, I literally... I have to do this. So the question is... Since I don't need the, the four notes... Oh, it uses it all up. That makes sense. It makes sense, but that is a bummer. Uh, it uses them all up regardless of if you um, only... You, you know, like, the base was four for that or whatever. Uh, or, or, yeah, four to seven. So, even though we had six, it used up all six. Makes sense. Makes sense. Um, I'm leaning towards replacing this. It's a lot of coins. We're going in on the farm game. I don't know if it's going to pay off. Oh, God. We really don't... We just don't have a good way to do this right now. No notes. Um... Truthfully, a power cord goes a long way for us. And we're just going to have to start taking a hell of a lot of damage. We got our extra die here. A white gem. We could get Aspect of Healing. I don't really care. Fortissimo is the gain of reroll. That's another thing. Is Yeah, we're not getting as a, a huge amount of... Oof. Okay. 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 We need some... We need something powerful. Um... I kind of want that, but maybe we can get it next turn. This this is just like a little bit more important, I'd say, right now. We need some kind of like big kill power. Okay. Uh, uh sure. If we roll that on the first one, it's going to be like about a million notes. 
like that. Okay, um... We also get power cord. Should remove four notes. Yes. It's a lot of money too. I mean, we like we have to take that. Whenever you kill or capture a non-chest, non-door enemy this turn, gain how many clips? It's it's very tempting. I hate that that guy's going to do a million damage to me. Um, I hate that that's going to not do quite as much as I'd like. But now we can do some power cords. Again, I could kind of just activate this verse, get the temp gold, because we don't need the gems, you know? Or uh, we don't need the... We don't need to be doing more than two damage. Everybody here dies in two damage. Uh, except for the golems who... It doesn't matter. They have damage cap one. Any damage they take gets reduced to one anyway. So it doesn't matter if I'm doing like two billion. It's just, it's irrelevant. So I guess we... Again, we activate the verse. I want to get a bigger verse going soon. But um, power cord is making me not be compelled to do that. It was tempting to, to boast first, but I don't think that that's the call right now. Okay. Um, that's a pretty good die. Ooh. Five swords. I like that. I like that. Uh, double and a curse. We get the ability to boast How many turns left? Seven turns left? Okay, fine. I'll get that going, so we definitely get that out of the way. Uh, two damage coming in. Could be okay. If we get the four notes, we uh, we get a heal. We could get this, go for the... I kind of want to get the big boy. I kind of want the big boy. What can I say? We have aspect of healing if we truly need it. Is there anything that's just one note? Not quite. I'll be happy to do that, though, because we can end up replacing it. In fact, there you go. Boom. Never mind. Now it's now it's something. There's some notes. Keep rolling. Do we just keep rolling? Five turns left. Just try and make the most beautiful song imaginable. Blum, blum, blum. You know the you know the one. Blum, blum, blum. Oh, I'll take that for the stupid extra amount of gold we get there. Okay, um... Nice. We're, we're, we're pretty strong. It, we took a little bit of ramping, but we're, we're there. Should have probably done this first, huh? Two wild gems gain a random ability unless you have seven abilities. Uh, okay, you know what? 16 to 19 notes is AoE two piercing damage. Which is not actually great because we might not be able to get the chests. Nah, we'll do it anyway. Okay. We could do the full piercing, or better yet, no, because we have three shield because of all of the, the rerolls that we did there. That's actually even better. Go all in there. We have the three temp gold that's going to go away. Let's go buy something. Let's buy super duper die. I, I like this character. It's wild. It's an absolutely wild character, but I really like it. Four gold and enough experience to reach the next level. See, that's tempting. That's a really tempting little situation there. Uh, he does damage equal to my max HP. I'm just going to accept one damage. <laughs> oh, my word. At this point, like, I could, I could probably 
I could probably roll past. Like, we have so many magic, uh, so many notes, it'd be probably a good idea to roll past, but... Eh. Just, sure. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, now I wish I had the, um, the AoE piercing. For this one. But now I'm just too strong. Hmm. Okay. What's Undead Army? Capture a random... When did this happen? Oh, yeah, the lore chest. Capture a random skeleton in each active empty die. Add a fang to a random face on each other active die. Uh, great. Where'd the fang go? Oh, oh, I see what it's saying. Each other understood. Understood. Uh, we could, uh, we could do this, tap out, and kind of just, like, pop them here, or we could go... Go for like a bang, bang. Let this get petrified kind of a situation. Again, we have aspect of healing. It's tempting to use. We just, we don't take damage from that. So it just doesn't feel like there's a big reason to care. Uh, we obviously have lethal here, but I think that we have lethal like almost no matter what we do. Almost. And I kind of want to, um, oh, yeah, well, emphasis on the almost. And I want to see if we can, uh, get that. We did. We got that super duper note. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Super duper chests. Boast won't work against the treasure chest. I just, like, I'm struggling to find when I'm supposed to use it. There we go. Three turns left. Just trying to get as much score here as we can. Uh, let's just replace this at this point. We don't have to worry about it. God, this is silly. Oh, this character is so silly. Oh my god. Okay, we should keep our money at this point. Okay, I'm not so worried anymore. Undead army. Give a fang. Fang on every single die now. It's really hard to pass this up. It's so hard to pass this up. We do that while we can get him out for free there. Feels like it's a good call. It's hard to say no to that, too. Uh, we have all the temp gold. Uh, I'm gonna just re roll past. Oh my god! This is scary. This is this is this is actually, believe it or not, this is a scary situation. Uh, obviously, that seems very tempting, and we have aspect of healing. We could we have no way to heal ourselves up. Two wild gems is interesting. We could get a bunch of undead army. We could do I could do boast. Okay, it's like a one-time. Gotcha. So... Hmm. It's 28. Uh, you know what? Great. Another undead army for the road. Look at our freaking dice. I don't know that I've ever had... I don't think I've ever had dice face that look this absolutely, completely chaotic. Can we get more coins? Okay, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Alright. There we go. I, and there I was, worried about, like, wave two when we maybe didn't quite meet the limit there. Alright, this character is... It's got potential. 
This, okay, this character's got potential. I like it. I was a little overwhelmed at first, but you, you had me, you had me the first half, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I think we have to, we have to risk it, you know, like, Frozen Horror has been giving us some troubles. Uh, whenever you kill an enemy with exact piercing damage, do piercing damage to another player, player. I mean, I feel like that's a pretty good call to go for uh, Wind Rider's bow on that one then. Like, it's good to take piercing when that is the situation. Um, bottomless pouch is certainly nice to make sure you are forced to keep tempo. I don't think I need Tome of Wisdom. Like, I don't know how uh, attached I am to that at the moment. Wither, unfortunately, is not a debuff that you have. Well, you don't have a debuff face that is a withered face. Effect will capture ongoing. Get 200 points at the end of the scenario. It's a groupie. You can get a groupie. Okay. Just You get 200 points just for having that? Okay, that's interesting. Uh, end a turn without an attack. Without attacking with a die, add a charge to a random ability. Certainly nice at the end of the... Yeah. I love Adventure Kid, especially when we got four things there. Start with your third die unlock, but start with half your starting life. I think we can go for that, too. And then I'm leaning towards... Okay, so what else we got? Oh, get an extra reroll each turn on this character? You kidding me? Of course. So we're gonna... Yeah, the half HP is a little bit uncomfortable, obviously. But I think it's worth... Fishing for coin. Coin die faces right away. Um, come on, like, come it, I was gonna say, what are the odds that I don't get uh, anything that gives us two damage? It just seemed unlikely. Okay, does damage equal to its attack when it dies, when frenzy? I mean, it's good, good guy to get freaking rid of right away. That being said... I kind of want a shield. I said I kind of want a shield. There's one shield. This is two separate piercing faces. Seems a little bit more appealing right now. Uh, De Capo. This turn ability stay active at the end of this turn. Keep your attack multiplier, shield, and temporal gold for the next turn. Oh, that's fun. So, this is active. So, we could do this to keep it active next turn as well. Very curious, very curious. Current versus get four health, which has some appeal to it, I can't deny. Not really the target I wanted to hit with that. But yeah, I, I'm having a tough time of, with deciding when I should use Boast. You know? Is there a rerollable white gem somewhere? A reroll white gem would be godly. Okay. Just keep rolling. Like I know, I know there's good stuff there, but just keep rolling. Rollable, rollable life steel sword. Oh, that's better than this for sure. Or that, I guess. Okay, come on, two damage, please. Thank you. It's just like I don't know if I should boast. It feels stupid to boast right then, right? Like two, two doesn't feel good enough. Game four temporal gold is our current. Unless there's anything like wildly interesting. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, this is about to get gross. Um the wild gems. Means I could fortissimo once, and then we're out of fortissimo.
pain. I just wither has been ruining me. Wither has been absolutely ruining me. But do I tap out of this now? Oh, we were so close. All right, just have faith. Just, just have faith, I guess. Ah, oh, torment, absolute torment. Do we activate the verse? Like, is it? I feel like maybe. Can we kill it? I don't know if we can. I'm like, I'm actually hurting for money. We're not really getting any good. Um, money faces that we're putting on here. Pretty unlucky on that front. Yeah, I think we, I think we have to there. I think we have to. Then we could take a white gem, I guess, but we don't really have a strong, strong use for two white gems. I'm looking for money. Great. Thank you. Um, I don't have, yeah, like I said, I don't have an overwhelming need for white gems right now. So I'll, I'll, I'll replace that. You can just... Can't, can't attack frozen guys, and I don't really need to. All right. Uh, feels like a re-roll to me. We could go... Um, We can't go all in. We can't go all in. Hmm. Please. Thank you. So it's not going to be able to do damage to me. We have the shields up. That helps a lot. Uh, we could take two damage. Sucks that that's gone, but hey, what are you going to do? I'm hurting. Gain four health. Tempting. It'd be one shield, so we would still get withered, would we not? I don't need the key. I don't... Ah. Uh, man. Hmm. Something. At this point, like, yeah. Just having exactly four works for me. Fine. I need to get rid of... What's that empty... Oh, it's not an empty face. It's a, it's a two-note face. I mean... I guess I'll attack. There's a world where I can kill that guy, I, I, I suppose. Or temporal gold, what's the next one? It's a 12, it's the two wild gems. I really need the wild gems. The temporal gold, I could. I could get that. I could find, like... Uh, imagine everything just for that imagine if we roll it ooh please nice we have seven so these guys uh, if we we need to hit them with piercing attacks otherwise problems happen. That's kind of why I wanted piercing. We don't have, like, that... M we don't have that much, though. We have... Poisoned is fine. I can deal with poisoned. Deal with poison curse. 
Okay. Nice. We can actually maybe do something. I would like to get rid of that face. There's the coin over here. It's not like a wow moment, though. We don't have... There's no better coins than that? I guess this is fine. It's not bad. And then we can do... Ooh, this is not bad as well. Uh, do we care as much about the notes at this moment? Maybe not. Double cursed. <laughs> Double cursed. Four temporal gold. This is, um... This is a shame. This is almost a kill. But I'll tell you what. These are non -pier or like these are piercings, so I feel like that's just a good start. Oh, God. For temporal gold, what would I do with it? I would replace something. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Triple wild gems. Like, it's cool. The, the, the shield is cool because uh, it keeps me from dying. Like, the, all the gold is cool because it's gold. But, like... I need... Yeah. Like, I need to... There we go. Just get that action going a little bit. Huge. Like, I guess I should be boasting then? Like, now I have less of a reason to not boast. Because, like, what do I even really care about anymore? Take double there? Do I... Am I dying? What's happening? How am I not dying, though? Oh, because of the shield. But only if I keep it. Or I could try and chance getting this, or I could just die. Ouch. I think we're dead. Oh, we're dead now. Oh, we're dead now. Oh, we're dead now. I should have taken it. The greed. I, but I could have gotten the, I could have gotten this, you know? I could have gotten this and killed, and then we would have actually been in a spot where we would be fine. Maybe. Maybe then would we be okay. Uh, but yeah, we were on the wrong verse. Um, I feel like, yeah, if we had less right now, we'd, we want to be down lower right now. Like, I don't need all these gems. To be clear, is that there's nothing I can do to really care right now. Like, cool, I have all this stuff, but like, yeah, what do I do with it? I can't do anything that would keep me alive. Pain, absolute pain. I will tell you, God, this one is uh, annoying. Second of all, we never got back up to full from, I think we can do a salty run back. But thank God, this is so much better. Um, we never got right back up to where we needed to be. That's a really good start, though, with uh, with HP, and we never really found our footing with gold. Like, there's some crazy gold stuff going on there. What the heck? Doing it. Again, just gold sounds great right now. Gold, gold sounds so nice right now. Add a note to two random faces on your dice until the next time you take damage, gain two gold at the end of each turn. Oh, that's wild. I, I don't think I can have, I don't think I can do it right now. Right. Yeah, that that HP situation is it's a bit painful. Not the target I needed to hit. That's a bit painful too. Get a note. Maybe that's okay. Come on. 
hit hit a note. Okay. Finally, we're not going to get withered by that fool. Maybe we should have boasted. I, again, it's just... That's what I have the most difficulty with, is when am I supposed to boast? When, like, when should I do it? Like, obviously, when you're going to hit lots of units. But it's kind of like this weird thing to predict. Oh, this is interesting. It's this weird feeling thing to predict, you know? Frost Ritual. Sacrifice captured enemy and target die. Each enemy with attack lower or equal to that gets frozen too. Hmm. I'm like, okay, like this looks nice, but I don't know if it's as nice as... Uh, you know what? I can, I, I can drop one coin for that extra goodness. I do really want a a shield so bad, but... I guess that's just not in my uh, in my cards here. For temporal gold. Uh, at this point, whatever. Sure, 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 sure. I'll take I'll take that at this point. And then we got that. We got the the wild gem business going on. Do piercing damage to two piercing damage to each enemy. Thank you. Uh, Reroll heart and moon piercing attack with coin. This is going so much better than any other attempt so far, like already. Ooh, I don't hate this. This is just a. It's a, it's a big stall turn, but, like, that is okay, because that's a lot of HP. Okay, three shield already. I mean, we just keep... We keep rolling, right? Oh, I'm so tempted to do that, but... We keep rolling, because we... Are trying to fish for money. Fish for the money. I don't have a lot of great faces to completely replace. This is quasi appealing. Okay. It's like the only one I really don't want to be hitting. That piercing damage is very tempting too. Oh we Oh wait, no wait, that it doesn't double it. That being said, do I care? Maybe it's nice. No. One damage there, thought out one. Okay, who? Too clean. Okay. Um, face removal. Kind of nice when we 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 kind of actually have some nice dice. I'm gonna do that. We actually have some nice dice. Two piercing damage to all the enemies. Very tempting to do. I'm doing it. These guys are really annoying for us right now. That's the face we need. Like, truly, that is probably the best I can really expect to go for. I don't even think I... Eh, I'll do it. I'll... What, are you withered? Just got withered? That's not that big of a deal, actually. Same thing there. That gets frozen. What happens there? When this face is rolled, you get you lose all your rerolls. Uh, non-piercing face attack. I mean, this is a non-piercing attack. Yeah, I don't really. Yeah, I think we'll be fine. Okay. Um, 
I don't want to lose that die. Like, let's let's wait for something sillier. Like that. Like, now I, I, I couldn't care less. That can go away. Got the temporal gold one. It's a maybe. We're on the final wave. Again, and it is just... Boy, howdy. It is just... It is just the way it is, ain't it? Okay. Can do better. Okay. Two wild gems. Do I care about the wild gems right now? Really? Not really. But we're we're, we're fine. We're not gonna take any damage here. Is the thing. So there's no risk. Like, maybe the random ability we get would be good. Maybe. We're gonna just do this again. Fortissimo. I mean, it's very good. I have faith. We have a lot of temp gold. Ooh, triple flaming fist attack. Curious. Certainly curious. I mean, the gold's gonna go to waste. So let's check out something else here. Ooh. Cursing attack. Double coin. Tri triple uh, triple blade and a stun. If we roll that, that'd be really good for, for this guy. So, like, I'm gonna put it on one of these ones that's a little bit tougher to hit here. Or a little bit less tough to hit. Sorry. Exact opposite. My bad. Gain four health is our current thing, so we can actually get away with that. Uh, oh, that's annoying. That gives us a chance in the next one. Like, we probably have... We can probably get lethal here. But we got Fortissimo. That's really what I wanted. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's done. We're free. I'm free. Boast. I'm free. And we get like... Yeah, it's 782. Not like a crazy amount. Dream Saver. Pants of Resonance. Uh, Dream Saver. What is that again? Score full points. You score the full point bonus and keep your streak when selecting non-score rewards, but your streak does not increase. Score the full points bonus and keep your streak when selecting non-score rewards. Your streak doesn't increase. I guess the phrasing on it has me a little confused here, but uh, this is probably a new thing. Whenever you activate a verse, gain a shield, start with the ability Tale of the Warrior. Until the next time you take damage, your non-fang attacks to deal an extra damage. Oh. I like that. I also like that we finally got the Frozen Horror done. It's it's That one has always been a little bit of a bane of my existence. Let's go Vampire Nest. And honestly, let's take these pants. And uh, the free extra reroll. I feel like the reroll is just so good with the bard when you're trying to, if you want to try and accrue um, extra notes. It's irrelevant that they do extra damage right this second, but hey. Temporal gold. Great. Until we need to do two damage, I'm just going to say, like, I don't care. More charges for boast. I don't. I, I don't. I don't. I gotta be honest. It's my least favorite thing in the character. It's not because it's bad at all. It's just it feels so limited, but also not like Im wildly impressive to me. You know, this character is very good. Like they're very, very good. I like that. I just wanted to kill and get like a little extra something, something. Fortissimo power card. I mean, wave two, four. I mean, 
a shield goes a long way on this one. Kind of silly how much it does. The thing is, it's until you take damage. How about we just don't take damage? I'm sure that'll be easy. It makes this tempting to just kind of keep. That guy's is a piercing attack. He got lucky. He got lucky. Not for long. Not for long. We got three white gems. We got three white gems and three fortissimos that we even can possibly do. This is irrelevant to me. We have our shield, right? Yep. Okay. A little bit of an awkward scenario on this. Unless we want a power cord. <sighs> Nothing to do with that, really. That hurts. That hurts when I'm like, I, I don't really know what I would spend that money on right now. Like a boast. What the heck? Sure. Boast. Get the... Extra notes? Sure. Fine. I'm just going to do it while we definitely can get a little bit of resources. I mean, the note face, it's not like a dead draw face. It's just not great. Like, hopefully we get a random blue spell at some point, I guess. Like, it would have to be from something up there. Yeah. Yeah, about this. We're gonna need a, uh, we're gonna need a shield. Fortissimo! It's really, it's really good. <laughs> don't, don't get me wrong, this is really good. I can always just put the ability back on, but, uh, just, like, like, any bit of, any bit of resource would be really good. So, okay. All right. Need more red gems? We do actually need a bit more red gems. Did I take damage? Huh, that didn't do the thing it said. Interesting. Did I take fear? Does fear count as attack damage for all intents and purposes? Wait, no, wait, what? It's doubled over here. Why is it not doubled over here? Wait, what? Is that just a bug then? In circadian dice? I don't think I've seen one of those. Like for real. Is that, why would it not? I like, I'm, I'm, I'm continuing to look I don't believe. I, I refuse to believe I found a bug in circadian dice. It's unheard of. I probably. I'm like I. I must have gotten something wrong. <laughs> I. I. When I got. I must have. I must not be understanding something correctly. Good. Uh, let's start smacking that. We can leave the bat. It's only this one, so it's like uh, no. It's nobody's working there now. I don't know. Yeah, uh, Fortissimo plus Time Twister Orb. Choice. Absolute choice. I need something really good to put here. Better. Yeah, we can make it a D3 and... Ah.
Nah, okay. I don't know. I definitely want to buy something. I guess this is good enough for me. Ooh! At this point... Sure. I have no shield. This is awkward. How many turns? Three turns left? I don't block at all. We would get power cord though. Oh, huge. Um, yeah, we just, we, we just, we, we go for the kills. We don't, we don't fuss. We don't fuss there. Putting this down so we get like a nigh guarantee of a wombo combo is also very tempting. I'm doing that here. I know we're missing out on a little bit by making that happen, but we, we could get a, I don't know. We're setting up like a really good middle combo dive but it only activates on this right now. It's like, that's not, it's not great. Fortissimo, let's save it. Ah, come on. Unless we were also getting power cord there. Ay -ay -ay -ay. I'd have to Fortissimo. Unless I could go, for, I, I could do my big old big boy. Here's the thing. What else is power cord for, right? I'm gonna actually take fear, so I still no, that counts. Okay, so that counts. Is that is that something? Is that what's going on? Is there something weird with that? Because like, there's a that one I'm a little bit more understanding of being like losing this streak situation. Whoa! I'm just doing it. Get the attack multiplier, sure, 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 but at this point I'm kind of just like, let's um... Let's stack up the 32, right? There's the 31. Okay. Oh my. Kind of just have to leave him there in a way. Ooh. We actually can do better though. So, sorry, we got this. Uh, the face symbol has attack equal to the to total number of non-fang attack symbols on non-legendary faces on this die. Um, it's kind of like, like, it's sort of like three is sort of the best, I guess. Great. Two turns left. We gotta we gotta do what we can here. <sighs> I wish we had re-rollable key. This is a guarantee of two chests. Is that like This is this is for all the marbles. Alright, let's just roll past guarantee we get the kill. Uh oh. Uh, really? <laughs> really? Really? <laughs> Little stinker. Come on, give me like a crazy attack one. Boy, oy, oy. Boy, oy, oy. Screw the freaking key. Who needs it? That's so annoying. Oh, that's so annoying. Oh, that's so annoying. We need a red gem roll. That, 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 
I don't care. Okay. Uh, bummed. I'm bummed. We lost our wombo. Okay, so what is it? Is 16 the two piercing to everybody? Feels like a good call. Okay. Just let him do it. We can even power cord him. No, we'd have to power cord him twice. It's funny. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Boast is a boast is a weird one, man. Don't even have enough notes to power cord big blast. We can power cord twice, actually, though, if we do this. Fine by me, and we keep we keep our extras. Keep our extra gold for the extra score to make up for the fact that uh, yeah, we probably didn't quite make it otherwise. Keep all the money. Okay, it matters. Activate first. Next turn, do we keep the temporal? I assume not. Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Oh, you've got to be kidding me. That really, that one missed, oh, that one missed roll that had somehow on all of our dice, on all of our dice, twice had no damage. <laughs> Apparently, uh, we get screwed out of the five star. There, There's a world here. How many stars do we have? We're at one, uh, 118. I may, off camera, literally just run through this again and get it to five star. Same with the, the ninja. When we get up to the points up here where there's like maybe we feel like we have to really start taking things that are not streak to go for the wombos uh, and get the high scores, then maybe you, maybe I'll be like, okay, those ones we save for on camera. But when it's just this little tiny, like we're off by just just the smallest little stupid amount. It feels dumb to do a full uh, a full on-camera playthrough again just for that extra one star. So I'm just letting you know I will probably play those off-camera just to get them up to the nice clean 2020. Just feels like it'll be better. But uh, Bard is an incredible character. I love them so much. They are very very weird, very wild, very fun. But last, last, if you want more circadian dice, you're going to have to let me know in the form of a comment down below. Make sure you like the video every single day when they come out. 10 a.m. CST is when they're supposed to show up. So, hey, the closer to that time that you watch it and enjoy it and like it and comment, the better. It really does help out with the algorithm uh, a great deal. All of that stuff, it it matters. I wish it didn't matter as much as it does, but it but it does. So, hey, if you want to help me out, uh, it, would go, it, would, it would go very far. That's all. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you. Check out the channel for Rogue Like some more every single day, and I will see you next time. Bye.